Hello and welcome back. I'm Mike. I'm Ryan. And today we have another unboxing, this time from the OCG land. We have Ignition Assault. Ignition Assault. Yeah, so this is like one of the last ones when it comes to like the rain stuff. We got one more after this, which I can't remember the name of now because I'm stupid and think look research it beforehand. But let's get into it. Uh, we've got a couple of new things in this. I think we've got this. Eternity code. Eternity code, thank you. Um, in this, we've got the Ignisters. I don't, I don't know whether I should pronounce the at the beginning or not. Whether it's at Ignisters or just straight up Ignisters. Ignisters is easy to say. It's much easier. Uh, is AI and. It's not. Is this Sen Senka? Or Senka Legend. Senka. Or Senka. There you go. Oh no, there's one. Oh no. What? Never mind. What? Don't spoil. No spoils. Uh, right, let's get into this thing. So, as is always with these, I can never open them up. So, if you have, <laughs> no, you, did a, you, did a good, you did a fine job for once. When? Just now. No, I mean like open up the actual packs. Oh no, you're just trash. It's the worst. Oh, I can't even get. Ah, oh. <laughs> can't even organize these. Right. There's more packs in these. Yeah, there's 36 packs in these. See, a lot more. But you get less cards per pack. Right, mm. should we do the time old tradition of trying to open it this way? I don't know, is that the right way? It is the correct way, because there's a little tab. Up right here, see? And uh, see so you fail. And then you go, yeah, and you fail straight away. That is just the worst. I think it's because you pull away from it. Because you don't want to, you like, I don't want to damage the card. So you don't. Perhaps. So we're going to streamline this one uh, this time. With the last few, we've kind of gone through trying to name all the commons. We're not going to today. We'll just go f um, name all the supers. And, and, and above. And higher, so... Maybe, maybe, no, we're not in the res. Okay, so, pretty butterfly thing. Ooh, a ritual card. And we start with just a rare. What number is that? It's, num it's number 12, so he is Senka Justice. So he's a new one, Ooh. Wan Yun. Oh, is that based off the Three Kingdoms? Uh, Romance of the Three Kingdoms? Uh, uh, I, it's possible, because like, what, there's Guan Yu. In like Dynasty Warriors, which is yeah, it's essentially stuff. Dynasty Warriors. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. There you go. Run into the free kingdoms. Nice. There you go. See, you knew something without knowing something. Sydney Dale didn't stop that. It's like you were a poet, but you didn't quite realize. I'll it. go away. No, you didn't. That's what you did. <laughs> right. Ooh, That's going to be another Sanko one, thing. I think. It's a mallet of some sort. We've got a trap of the dragon. And it's all ritual. rare. Ritual. And 39 is Megalith Bethor. Ooh. Effect ritual monster. So we've got a lot of rituals in this. Bring back, bring back rituals. All over type suck. Really? Synchros are cool. <laughs> I'm just getting better open these. I don't, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> oh, it's an Ignister look. So you've got the app. Ah. So there's an Ignister. Ritual. Man, this is a really a ritual set, isn't Ignister. it? Ignister. <laughs> Number 58, so that's on your screen there. Uh, Kar oh, Karaki Todai, oh, Karakis! Karakuri, Karakuri, sorry. Karakuri, is it? Yeah, yeah, oh, I haven't seen them in ages. Oh, there you go. That's what everyone says, like, oh, mate, they were in, like, two sets ago. And I'm like, <laughs> well, sorry, I'm just following. Okay, this pipe wasn't too good opening. Right, okay. Another Ignista, we got, okay, so there's quite a few in this. So they're kind of cutey. Looking weird things. That has to be. Oh, it's not a trick star. That's not a trick star. I need to check though. It's a ghost trick fairy. It's ghost trick. Okay. Close enough. That's going to be a Karakuri, I think, again. What's the number? Number 15. So he is Karakuri Toad. Oh, he does look like a frog. Is that MDL? Is that model? Uh, 4624. Shiro Model. Kunishi. Yeah, 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 yeah. Model. <laughs> Shiro Kunishi. Cool. So there's a lot more of this in here than I thought it was going to be. Oh yeah, can you see the list there? It's like one, two, three, four, five. It's quite a lot of them. Okay. Yeah. Like again, we've got this dude again. Which one? Is it a light of dark wood? And okay, we've just got nothing but rares so far. Uh, Fifty-five. Uh, Senka Legend, the three visits. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, it's very much. If these come to the TCG, I'm gonna be all over it. I forgot to mention as well. This is the first one to get a new rarity. Oh, the 10,000 secret rare. They only place a one monster. One monster, which you can only get in 10,000 secret rare. You want to say the name now? I'm going to say the name now. Oh, okay. You ready? 10,000 dragon. Because he is the 10,000th card that Konami in Japan have produced. 
It's a little bit better than a five-headed dragon. I think the... Ooh, we got a super. Ooh. Design-wise, though... And a rare. Okay, no, you Is got that some. a hero? No, um, one behind it. Yeah, what time is that one? He is Megalith Ophiel. Ah! So he's in effect which one's there? Okay, oh. so we have a super. And then an Ignister as well. Oh, it's an Ignister. He looks, he looks like he could be an e-hero. Uh, Earth Golem Ignister. Oh. Just all elemental based. Of course they are. Of course they are. I'm intrigued. I gotta really research the Ignister. They seem quite interesting. And before you say, I, have to say I haven't watched Range to that point yet. I haven't. I mean, I haven't watched Range at all, so. Yeah. <laughs> Loads of Richard Monsters, and we got another Ignista. Just in case, number one, so that's uh, Picari. Ah, Picari, yeah, can I used to. I don't know what that means. No. So, as is always with these, you can always expect something, one card to be higher than a secret rare. Uh, it's usually an ultimate rare, but can be a 20th secret rare as well, which is quite nice, which I'm hoping I get a 20th secret rare. That would <laughs> no. be, be very <laughs> He's nice. He's got a javelin of meat of cheese. What's he called? He is. Um, Tune Knight. Yeah. Oh, he's got Tune. <laughs> Tune Knight. Oh, brilliant. Right. Moving on. Oh, we got a Link Monster. <laughs> it's the first one, actually. That's quite impressive, considering. Number of... Oh, okay. So we have an Ultra Rare there. Number... Oh, is that the new Gizmek? Number 24 is Gizmek Mikazuchi, the Nuclear Emperor. What a name. Yes. The rare. artwork in the Gizmek is amazing. Okay, we've got to find out what he does. Okay, so, with this guy, if a monster is in the extra monster zone, you can special summon this card from your hand. Well, that's a free summon. Oh. You can target one face-up monster in the extra monster zone, equip that face-up monster to this card, maximum one. When this card destroys an opponent's monster by battle, you can special summon one monster card you control equipped to this card. You can only use the effect, each effect of Gizmek Mizuguchi Nuclear Emperor once per turn. That's, that's pretty cool. Yeah, and he's you uh, get a, you, you 2750. You free up the extra deck, extra monster zone. Very nice. He is pretty. All right. So. Machine too. They all the gift mix, aren't they? It's no, it's not. 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 It is I. It says this name's I. It says on the card. Oh god, it is. Oh, this is an AI card then. Which one number? Uh, fifty-two. AI die reborn. Wow. Is it I or is it AI? I don't. The way it's they got AI. it here. It's AI. The way they got it here is I, but the way on my screen is A dot capital I dot. It's probably like it's meant to be AI, but they probably say call it I because it's more it's more of a name. I, w I want comments, people, tell me, am I pronouncing this I, I or my I die, I die Reborn sounds better than AI Die Reborn. Oh, hang on. Is it meant to be Idle Reborn? I Die Reborn. I don't think it's Die. I think it's D-L-E. So let's read it. Idle, yeah. Yeah, it's Idle. That's what that is. Okay, so I was right with the I. Uh, let's just read this one now because I was, we've talked about it so much. Uh, target one Ignister monster in your graveyard, special summon it. Also, you cannot special summon monsters for the rest of this turn except Cyburst monsters. When an attack is declared involving two monsters, you can banish this card from your graveyard and one card from your hand. Then target one of your AI or I spells traps that is banished in your graveyard. What? Or in your graveyard, I'm sorry. Except Idle Reborn and it's your hand. You can use the effect of Idle Reborn once per turn. It's been pretty good. Pretty Support decent. for the AI slash cyber thing. So do, do the AI slash I support the Ignisters? Is that the monster again? Well, it's any cybers, it seems. The super? Yeah, that's a super, isn't it? Uh, is this. Oh, my brain, come on. Yeah, Sky Striker. Uh, Sky Striker Ace Rose with a Z. Rose. 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 <laughs> and a ref. Yeah, that's a, a Linky monster. Uh, he is Gravity Controller. There you go. So, with very few Link Monsters in this set, but I think they're focusing on the, the Ritual ones, mostly. Well, they focus on, like, every other archetype bar as well, so, like, Rituals had, like, a little bit here and there, so why not give me some love before Dreams ends? True. Oh, oh, we got an Ultra. That looks like a Thunder Dragon. 
Uh, not, it right. is not. It is uh, Megalith Aratron. Ah! Aratron, yeah. Okay, let's have a look at him. Ritual? Uh, but, uh, oh, he's ritual, isn't he? Good lord. Uh, you can ritual summon this card with any Megalith card. During the main phase, quick effect, you can discard this card, ritual summon one Megalith ritual monster from your hand by tributing monsters from your hand or field whose total levels equals or exceed this level. When your opponent activates a card or effect the target card you control, quick effect, you can place one ritual monster from your graveyard on the bottom of the deck, and if you do, negate the activation. And if you do that, destroy that card. You can only use each effect of Megalith Aratron once per turn. Oh, so they, they, they ritual, their ritual spells are each other. Perhaps. Because, like he says, you can only ritual some of this card with any Megalith card. So that means you could use another Megalith yeah, ritual yeah, monster yeah. to ritual summon that, as long as you've got all the materials uh, in the field. And he's got a blue screen of death. That's not cool. My PC just crashed. So the audio will be just a bit weird whilst I go and fix this. Bear with me, people. Right, so carrying on to the next pack. What have we got? We got two ultras already. Oh, and two supers. Two supers. Give us a fancy. We're not asking for the well, 10,000. But... <laughs> that would be it'd, nice. It'd be nice, but uh, we're not asking for it. Get in shot. There we go. All right. There's another eye card there. Mm. Is he big touching me? Oh. They don't know what that is. Doesn't matter. Oh, <laughs> actually, no, we're doing rares, haven't we? Uh, number 50 is over here. That is Ignister Island. <laughs> Again, with the AI for Island. Yeah, that works. I'm just telling people that you can see it. That's the thing on the screen. Okay, it's a field spell. So Moving on. Ignister field spell. So that does say that the eye cards are in conjunction with. Hang on, the. Yeah, so the eye cards are all spells. Yes. I didn't notice that. Now I have. Ignis Star. Block of Cheese. And have we had him? No. He's uh, going to Sanka Champion Zhang Di. Yeah. Okay, yeah, we haven't had Zhang Di, but we had somebody else like him. If you play Dynasty or Dice Warriors, Zhang Pei. Right. It's like Landy from Shenmue. It's just a combination. Shenmue and Dynasty Warriors. He's gonna be another one, isn't yeah, he? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ooh, look at the ritual card. Ooh, Ooh. You're super. On your page, sixty-seven. Sixty-seven. Yep. Lightning storm. Ooh, ooh. I think I know something about this. Go into it. I think it's quite interesting. Opening now. Open switch. If you control no face of cards, activate one of these effects. One, destroy all attack position monsters your opponent controls. Nice. Or destroy all spell and traps your opponent controls. Broke. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, no, non-targeting destruction. Nice. Very nice. I mean, that may change when I come out here. It may have the words target your opponent's monsters. Who knows? We just like we just like the rare igniter. Igniter. Uh. Oh, water dragon. Got him again. Huh? Butterfly. Thing. Again. Got very soon. Oh, dragon mates. <laughs> they have to come over here, but they'll be soon. Ooh, and cool. twenty-two, we got. Utgar, General uh, G General Deer, Boss of Lies. I don't He's know. He's a lion boy. <laughs> Go there. Right, side one, done. This feels like a regular set. What a TCG set. Two ultra, two two ultras are higher in one side. <laughs> you got three supers. That's not right. Yeah, we'll, we'll, have four we'll, supers. we'll have a secret and at least an ultimate rare in this side. In in, in this side. I believe that's the the, the video. I do want ultimate rare. I do too, which is why I love these Japanese sets. Um, ghost, rares, ghost rares can go away, but so yeah, let's get this. Ugh. Yeah, get the box. The box rubbish. Box is gone, right? It's everything. It's the ghost it's tricks. Cloud, isn't it? cloud, cloud thing. It's Mister. It's a super straight off the bat. It looks like a dragon maid. Uh. Abominable Unchained Souls. There's more of the Unchained Monsters. Oh. Let's have a look what he does, because the Unchained ones are quite interesting, actually. Oh. So, if a card you control is destroyed by card... No, oh, sorry, by I... battle or card effect, you can special summon this card from your hand. Oh. If this card is special summoned, you can discard one card and destroy one card on the field. That can be either person's side. Cool. Once per turn, during the end phase, if this card is in the graveyard because it was destroyed on the field and sent there this turn, you can special summon this card but place it on the bottom of the deck when it leaves the field. You can always special summon Abominable Unchained Soul once per turn. Sounds right. 
Pretty cool. Oh. Oh, I thought it was a link. It's a link monster we haven't had yet. It's Igniter. Uh, Ignister. Uh, it is Fire Phoenix Ignister. Oh. Yeah. There we go. Next pack. My camera is wonky. When did that happen? <laughs> How did that happen? Full of technical difficulties. Oh my good, it's me. Right. It's slowly wonking its way off or something. That sounds bad. I'm gonna stop saying wonking itself off. That is no, not. No, no, you didn't. You said wonking its way off. Oh, okay, good. Okay. It's not much better. It wasn't so bad then. That's good. Right. <laughs> Let's move on. Let's moving on. Cards. What have we got? Ooh, that's this creepy one. 59, oh, that's on your side. 59 is, uh, whoa, Con Condolence Puppet. Okay, then. Yep. <laughs> I'm not sure what I want in Ultra Rare, in all honesty. Um, I know it's going to be, not Ultra Rare, sorry. It's going to be one of the Ultra Rares, which are, I think there's a couple of Ignisters mm. and stuff like that, but I'm not sure which ones I'm after, so I'm happy for, for whatever, essentially. Oh, it's super rare again. Number 66, please. It is a... Oh, God. Kujikiri Amulet. What does it do? Oh, phone, please. Browser, please. <laughs> it's about there not doing anything for us. Uh, send one level nine monster from your hand or face up uh, face up fields to the graveyard. Draw two cards. You're gonna activate one of this card or of this effect once per turn. If it's getting rid of level nine, is that the unchained dudes? Yeah, no, no, he's over there. Right by there. Oh, the eight. Seven. He's eight. Um, but the the um, Gigamax. No, not that. What's his name? Yeah, the Gizmec. Gizmec. He's level nine. Yeah. And then we've got number 17, oh, which isn't on my screen right now. Uh, it is Arc Jet Light Crafter. Of course Ooh, it, it is. is cool. Of course it is. Oh, what the. <laughs> All right. Camera's seemingly staying in place now. Good God. I can't believe I let that go so far without even noticing. I wonder why it was so much difficult to get the cars on screen. All right. Yeah, is that that? Too nice. Choo choo. Uh, we've got That's Guan Yeah, we've Guan, had it before. We Guan, Guan, Yun. Guan Yun. Guan Yun. Ugh. I swear one day I'll tear these cards in half. Mm -hmm. I'm open them up. And it'll be an ultimate rare. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> That'd be the worst. Oh, oh ultra, ultra rare. Ultra him. Number 11. So that is uh, Senka Noble. Lu Yeah. Lu Juan. Lu Juan? I don't know. That's as probably as close as we're going to get to it, and all honestly, yeah. without making it worse. Alright. There's an eye hammer thing. And then we've got. Uh, what's his name? Megalith Bethel. I've had him oh, before me. Repeat. Repeat ritual. Alright, we're getting there. Through. We're getting through slowly. I do like them they get O C G set. Not knowing yeah, fine. you know, knowing that you you don't like this, but I kinda intrigued by it, like getting a super rare could also be a secret rare kind of thing, you know. That's just that seems such hassle. Yeah, but like say like a lot of the uh, for example, let's say the Ignisters, they yeah. come in super rare form, but then you can get like secret rare versions. Like you can get it cheap, but if you want to, you can get the super knife ones. Just get the cheap one over you got Well, that's just you. Like, there was three Ignisters in a row there. <laughs> and, an, and an eye. eye trap. <laughs> what is what? that? It's a flirting card, this one. Uh, so look, 69. Oh dear. Uh, <laughs> uh eye shadow. Of eye shadow. Of course. <laughs> of course. <laughs> I like I like I actually kinda like that. <laughs> 77. Oh uh, um, Oh, Armory Call. Cool. Yeah. It's probably equipped spells, I imagine. Call the Armory. Call the Armory. Did you get this weird flower brain one? It's weird. <laughs> and then. <laughs> oh, okay. That's our secret rare. Uh, number 44. He is Light Dragon Ignista. Ah. That is very pretty looking. So he could have come in... Oh, he could have come in a holographic rare, which is essentially a ghost rare, uh, ultimate rare, or a 20th secret rare. 
Um, and an ultra rare. He could be like all the rarities, essentially. So what does he do? He requires two level four monsters. If a monster you control, let's put that in shot. If a monster you control will be destroyed by card effect, you can detach one material from this card instead. You can only use each of the following effects of Light Dragon that gets to once per turn. So essentially, let me just read that. Uh, you can detach one material from this card, destroy face up monsters your opponent controls, up to the number of existing monsters you control. When your other side based monster inflicts battle damage to your opponent, you can special summon one link monster from your graveyard. Okay, so the first part of that is you can discard a material. To stop, stop it from being destroyed by card So it doesn't effect. negate it, it just, just stops something from your side being destroyed. That's pretty interesting. Yeah. And then. You could also then detach another material to destroy a face-up monster your opponent controls. Yeah. Interesting. Oh, up to up to the number of existing monsters you control. So if you have like if you have a fight field full of them, then you destroy oh, them all. For one for okay, one cost. That's, that's even better. Jeez. Mm. Oh, I like this, you. I mean, the second one is pretty. Decent. I really got to research. I mean, this, 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 the second effect you can do without detaching. So yeah. So when you have the most cybers monster to fix battle damage opponent, you can special summon one lingos from your graveyard. I mean, come on. <laughs> Ignistas are interesting. Alright, you got the ritual certain thing. That's a messed up camel. <laughs> and 21 is Witchcrafter Genie. So Witchcrafter make its way into the set. Alright, so we got another ritual monster. Like five times, uh, like yeah, yeah, we haven't that. Ah, uh, it's like 50. Karakuri. Yeah, we've had that before. That's fine. We'll bother going through that again. Okay, so we're still hoping for an ultimate rare here. We've got all packed up for this. All right. Which which rare? Ultimate. I thought that other one was an ultimate. That's a secret. Ah. Uh, okay, it's, uh, we've had that token before, me. Yeah. Karakuri tail yeah. model full. I mean, model number, that's weird. They've always had, they had like models and stuff like that. They're like, you know, wood robots. Yeah. He looks good. Cool. got super rare. Another Ignista. 42, that's a good number. Wind Pegasus. Yes. Wind Pegasus. That's how I look at you. So they seem to have basically the Ignistas are like types all of all the types. Monsters. I mean, if it's the, if it's the AI. If this it's is the... where Dark Fluid could come into use, the final Dark Fluid, because you've got all your different types of monsters. Yeah. Uh, so one tuner plus one plus non tuner monsters. During your main phase, you can destroy spells slash traps your opponent controls up to the number of Ignistan monsters you control. What? <laughs> okay. If another card you control is destroyed by battle or an opponent's card effect while this card's on the field or in your graveyard, sorry, GY, you can banish this card, then target one card your opponent controls, shuffle it into the deck. You do lose, it's not like Stardust where it comes back, it is no. banished for good. You can only use each effect of Wind Pegasus once per turn. That's pretty nifty. I imagine there's a card that lets you get back what you banished. I think that's the three one. Uh, we think we've had that one. Uh, the three visits, yes, it yeah. is, yeah. Right. Three packs left. Let's see if we can get... I'm sure we can get an ultimate. I'm sure you meant to get one ultimate per, per box. Pretty sure that's the video. So I'll take an ultimate Ignista. Oh, I'm enjoying these Ignistas. I could really play with those, I think. Oh, oh my goodness me. It's not an Ignista. Ignista. Oh, I think it's a Senka. 43 it is Karakuri oh. Daigon Gen Model 00X. Buribu. 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 Okay, I, I <laughs> thought it was a Senka. He looks bad. He looks awesome. That, that's super shiny for an ultimate. I mean, to be fair, we had, when was the last time we saw an ultimate? Even, <laughs> even the... Even the side's shiny. What on earth? No, it, yeah, the side, the borders were shiny. Yeah, I know, but it normally it looks it's a lot less foily than it, I'm used to. If you know, if that makes any sense. Yeah, they the, well, they, they seem it, more textured normally. Oh, and, okay. Anyway, let's have a look at this dude. So one tuna plus one and plus non tuna mon uh, machine monsters mm -hmm. specific. If this card is synchro summoned. You can special summon one Karakuri monster from your deck. Your defense position monster cannot be destroyed by battle. Once per turn, if the battle position is a face-up Karakuri monsters you control is changed, except during the damage step, you can target one card your opponent controls and banish it. So it does target, but that is straight up just pure banishment rather than destruction. Yeah. So, so if people say they don't destroy... Can't be destroyed by color effects while this isn't destroyed, it's banished. It's banished, yeah. And plus you could use, like, you know, like spell cards to do that Yeah. yourself. So you can see it's definitely foily like it should be, but it just doesn't seem as textured as normal, which is... Seems a bit flimsy, I don't know. I think we'll play with that. I'll say open up the next pack. 
I know what you mean. Yeah, I can see it. It looks like it's textured, but uh, it can't. But maybe it's a, it does feel not as what I remember it. Yeah. But to be fair, I've opened the last few and they've, they've I mean, I said I have the Gizmec one and I've had dark fluid as well. Mm. Which I think I will get. Let's see if I can figure out where it went. Yeah, let's uh, get through these. You again, Genie. The last pack. We've got a couple of cool looking secret and ultimate. Yes. Yeah, so, I mean, I only have it for collecting purposes. Like, yeah. Of course, I get. I failed to open the pack on the last one. Oh, then I didn't have to open it. Oh, I should have said. What, yeah, what true. about you? My fault. It is. It's always your fault. <sighs> uh, gravity control. Yeah. Cool. Right, then we see if we can find Dark Food to compare. One second. Yeah. No. So, going back to comparing the ultra, Ultimate Rare, sorry. I did, as I said, pull the dark fluid last time around. Let's have a look at this. And honestly, it's not as thick as I remember. So perhaps I'm just being a bit nuts. No, that one does seem much more shiny. Oh, I don't know. I, do, I mean, it's probably, it might be just because they put the, the color of the background makes it more shiny. Nothing's focused for some reason, but you know, there we go. It's a bit better. But there we go. I like my ultimates. Yum, 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 yum. Cool. There we are, that is uh, Ignition Assault, yes it is, isn't it? <laughs> Where's the box? Oh. Yeah, Ignition Assault, I remember the name of the, this. Um, this will be coming, I think, January in the TCG, so we'll obviously do an unboxing for that then. We're going to have some videos coming up soon. Not all of them are going to be unboxings because they're going to get a bit dry coming up. We've got... Special Edition. Of Rising Rampage. Mm -hmm. And we've got the Mystic Fighters, that's the one. Ah. Uh, that's the... Uh, in the few weeks time that's the next one it's a few weeks time um then we've got chaos impact special edition and speed trials of the kingdom at the same time yeah speed jewel trials of the kingdom yes and then legend Duelist magical hero on oh no that's january so legend Duelist is january <laughs> wait what hang on what? dark side of dimension movie pack secret edition yeah they're re-releasing the the dark side of dimension movie pack but now it all the secrets <laughs> no for no don't for flump sake <laughs> And then we got that as Ignition Assault, which is this. Well, there we are. I hope you enjoyed this. Sorry for the lack of audio quality. It's, um... Technical we, difficulty. We had a technical difficulty on the PC side of things where all the audio went... <clears throat> so there's that, unfortunately. But thank you for joining us. Uh, look out for more of these soon. And I said, we'll have some more interesting videos in the build-up to Christmas time. Look out for those. But until then, it is goodbye from me. And goodbye from me. See ya.